C I E T N C E R T presents audiobook of mathematics for class 3 entitled math magic 3 chapter 1 where to look from part 5 page number 11 this page has two parts each part has some pictures part 1 a black color ant is standing near six folded papers each paper has some drawing which is only half visible this ant is thinking can you guess these letters from their halves paper 1 is folded vertically that is in standing line the fold is kept at left side the folded paper is showing a slanting line from top to bottom right end there is a small sleeping line near right end towards left going into the paper fold paper 2 is folded horizontally that is in sleeping line the fold is kept on top the folded paper is showing curved line starting near the top left side and going towards bottom and turning to right side paper 3 is folded vertically with fold at left side and is showing a standing line near the right side there is a small sleeping line from the center going towards left side and into the vertical fold of the paper paper 4 is folded vertically with fold at left side and is showing a curved line starting from the center and going towards bottom left side and into the fold paper 5 is folded horizontally with fold on top The paper is showing a standing line coming from the fold near the left side of the paper and the top and bottom corner of this standing line are joined by a curved line from the right side. Paper 6 is folded vertically with fold at left side and is showing two slanting lines meeting at a point at the center of the fold the top line is extending towards top right corner and bottom line towards bottom right corner part 2 using such letters we can also make words which have similar halves the picture shows the black ant standing near four pieces of paper the ant is saying guess the words by looking at their halves paper 1 shows halves of three alphabet letters indicating the word has three letters letter 1 is at top and letter 3 is at bottom each half is drawn at the left side with space at right side to complete the letter letter 1 has a standing line at left side with a sleeping line from middle going towards right side letter 2 looks like a standing semicircle with opening at right side letter 3 looks like cone with open mouth paper 2 shows three letters halves drawn at left side with space at right side to complete the letter letter 1 is at top and letter 3 is at bottom letter 1 looks like cone without mouth and with left side smaller than the right side letter 2 has a slanting line from bottom left to top middle there is a small sleeping line at the center going towards right side 
letter 3 has two slanting lines joined at the middle of the paper. Line 1 is from top left to middle of the paper and line 2 is from middle of the paper towards bottom left corner. Paper 3 has six letter halves drawn horizontally at the top half of the paper. Letter 1 is at extreme left and letter 6 is at extreme right. Letter 1 looks like curved line ending abruptly at the center of the paper. Letter 2 and 3 look like two small standing lines drawn at some distance between them. The top of standing lines is joined by a curved line. Letter 4 looks like a cone without mouth. Letter 5 has three lines. Line 1 is a sleeping line at top. The left corner of this sleeping line has a small standing line. From bottom corner of this standing line starts another sleeping line. Letter 6 has a standing line. The top of this standing line has a sleeping line which curves at the end towards bottom and ends at the center. Paper 4 has four letter halves drawn horizontally at the top half of the paper. Letter 1 is at extreme left and letter 4 is at extreme right. Letter 1 has a standing line. The top of this standing line has a sleeping line which curves at the end towards bottom and ends at the center. Letter 2 has a small sleeping line. From the center of this sleeping line starts a downward standing line. Letter 3 looks like curved line ending abruptly at the center of the paper. Letter 4 has three lines. Line 1 is sleeping line at the top. The left corner of this sleeping line has a small standing line. From bottom corner of this standing line starts another sleeping line. Page number 12 Making a Mask This page has two parts. Part 1 has picture-based steps for making a mask. Part 2 provides three more pictures for making masks. Part 1 a black ant is saying, Now I can teach you how to make the mask of a cat. Take a piece of paper. Step 1. Fold it along the middle. The picture shows paper folded vertically from middle. Step 2. On one side, draw the figure. Picture shows half-drawn face of a cat. Step 3. Cut it out using a pair of scissors. Picture shows a scissor and cut face of cat drawn in step 2. Step 4. Now open the fold and make the eyes, nose, etc. The picture shows complete face of the cat with a dotted vertical line passing through the center of the face. Step 5. Color it and tie a rubber band on its back. Your mask is ready. Picture shows colored mask with long rubber band at the back. Part 2. You can make more such masks by taking help from the following pictures. There are three more pictures for making three more masks. Each picture is drawn on vertically folded paper. Picture 1 is a girl's face drawn in half. 
picture 2 shows half drawn face of an elephant. Picture 3 is half drawn face of a deer. The chapter 1 Where to look from? Part 5 Of total, 14 chapters of the book ends here. Narrator Akash Ahuja Sound recordists Batilang Lingdo and Mayank Kumar Assistance in production by Minakshi Kukreti Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary This book is presented to you by CIET NCERT New Delhi India